The war was long. The battles cruel, sometimes unbearable. The destruction insurmountable. But in the end, I alone stood as the victor. But this world had paid the price for our greed-filled war. There wasn't a place I could look that wasn't tarnished by the touch of conflict. Blood, bodies, and charred remains of ill-fated spacecraft littered the battlefield. All of this world's riches had already been plundered, foolishly spent in the short-sighted desire to secure it from enemies. I was the victor, all right. Proud owner of a worthless hunk of rock floating through space. There's nothing for me here now, so I will return to space once again in my quest for riches and adventure. I wish the best of luck to those who stand in my way. They're going to need it. Hey there, strangers! My name's Neos, and welcome to Cortex Command Void Wanderers, a total conversion mod that a lot of people have been asking me to do for a very long time. That transforms your plucky brain and its army of mindless clones from planet-conquering heroes to space-faring adventurers, complete with things like quests and travel and allegiances and all of that really cool fun stuff. This mod is actually surprisingly deep and kind of awesome. So we will jump into this and I will show you exactly what Void Wanderers is, so we'll start this up. And what we get to do here, right off the bat, is we get to decide who is in the game. So we we actually pick our own faction, then we pick the factions that we will encounter throughout our space travels. So I... I just, I'm, I'm trying to decide what I was going to be. I have decided I'm not going to be the brown coats because I always pick the brown coats. But there's so many of these other cool races that we could pick. But I have decided that I am going to play as the coalition, just the base coalition, just to be different and have just have some fun with being someone different. So we are going to be playing as the coalition as faction one, and our enemies or allies or whoever they end up being in the end. We are going to have to pick through all of these. I am not going to be picking the Ultramarines because they're stupidly overpowerful. And I have seen that apparently, if you manage to kill them and take their weapons, then you become unstoppable and it doesn't, it's not nearly as fun anymore. So we're not going to do that. And I'm also not going to pick the Imperial Guard because that's kind of the same faction. We're not going to mess with that at all. Our first enemy faction is going to be Space Pirates because we have to have Space Pirates. I was almost Space Pirates because, in all fairness, I, I did kind of annihilate an entire planet to take all of its gold and resources, so I may kind of be like a Space Pirate, but we're, we're the heroes. We're not Space Pirates, so Space Pirates will be our first enemy. And our second, who else? Oh, yeah. Down here we have uh, the Sergals. I've seen Sergals. I have absolutely no idea what they're from. They, but the important thing is that they are apparently budget price mercenaries. So we're going to have some mercenaries as enemies and or allies, depending on whatever, however that goes. These things, I don't even know what these are. These look really cool. They've escaped from some secret lab with extreme psi powers. So they've apparently got brain powers, or they'll use the force on me or something. I don't even know. But that seems like it'd be kind of cool, so we're going to do that. Let's see, the Techion. We haven't seen the Techion for a Let's use some Techion and some Imperitus. We're gonna, and we're going to actually fight against the Browncoats. we got to have the Browncoats as our enemies, and I'll probably end up stealing their weapons anyway, which will be totally cool. And finally, I think our last group will be the dummies, because the dummies have to be around. What What is Cortex Command without the dummies? I just, I love the dummies, they're so stupid and they're awesome. So, this is going to be our adventure with these groups of faction member peoples floating around in space and stuff. So, as you can see, we actually start off with the spaceship. We have our own, we have our very own actual functioning spaceship, which is just super awesome. And it is actually, it is in space. Because if you manage to go out here or something, or like break out the back door, you will just fall off into space and die. Like an actual spaceship, which is awesome. So, what we can do on the spaceship is all of these are different, um, these all serve different functions. Like this one right here, you can actually see that we are currently located at Trade Star 
peer number 792 because that's apparently where we are. And see so if we go over here, we see we have 2,000 gold to spend and we can actually go to other planets. We can actually travel to other places. I believe here we can actually travel to the same places within the same planet or something like that. And over here we can actually travel to other planets within the solar system. And over here, we actually have missions. This game has quests that you can actually like go and do all these different things. They actually have different objectives like locate and assassinate, assassinate, assassinate the enemy commander or wipe out all enemy forces or various things like that. I think there's other missions as well. But you have all of those and it actually shows you like who the target is, who you're working for, what reputation you'll get, how much gold you'll get for doing it. It, it has cool things like that because over here you can actually see our reputation. So this actually it matters who you're doing work for. So we actually have our reputation with ourselves is 649 because we are us and we seem to like us. So currently the Techion, Imperatus, and the Dummy Army don't care for us very much. Whereas everyone else just couldn't care less and doesn't even know we exist. But you can actually do missions and it'll you can decide who you want to be your allies, which is really cool. And I think over here, oh yeah, and here, you can actually level up your brain. You can give your brain more toughness or a force field or telekinesis or scanning or healing or self-healing. I don't know what the difference between that is. Uh, engineering, which allows you to fix weapons um, and a quantum spit splitter. I don't even know what that is, but it's super awesome. And then if you go over to this one, this is actually where you buy all of your weapons because we're at a trade store right now. We can buy weapons from this place and you can actually sort the different weapons you want. If you want pistols or rifles or any sort of stuff like that, you buy them from here. You can even buy bombs if you want to like that. We're not buy our napalm bomb or standard bomb. But that, that is really cool. And then that actually depends upon which trade star you're at. I think it might even depend on which factions you're allied with. Things will cost more or less or they'll have different things available at different trade stars. That sort of thing, which is really cool and add some more depth to this and then over here is where we can actually buy bodies we can because over there you buy weapons over here you can actually buy different bodies you can sort the bodies as well with different sorts of things there's a medical drone i should probably buy a medical drone but you can buy all these different things and it is really really cool so after you've bought those things right here is actually your clone storage vat this is actually where all of your clones are and you can actually sort them as well and it shows you the different weapons and stuff that they have actually i think you can actually select what weapon you want on them and stuff like that but i can click this and it'll actually bring out my dummies and i can just run them or not my dummies my clones and i can run them around and stuff and or i can send them right back into the vat by accident that's something you can do too and you store them in here because you only have so many out on your ship at once i think you can upgrade to have more but at the moment i can only have four i believe and then over here is where all of our weapons are stored. And you can sort through all your weapons and stuff too. And all of your weapons and items, like diggers and things. So if you want to give something to uh, one of your uh, uh, clone dudes, you just click over here and it drops it right there. And then come over here and pick this up. But if it's not picked up very fast, it actually puts it back up into the storage area. So anything that's actually dropped on your ship is put into your storage facilities so that you don't lose it for later. That is really, really cool. Um, okay, and then right here is the way that we beam down to planets, which is super duper awesome. So, I think the first thing that we should do is get ourselves a mission. So, what sort of missions do we have here? We've got brown coats versus Techion. So, everybody, let's see, what do we have here? Versus space pirates. Uh, what's this, a garrison? Our target? We gotta decide who we want to fight against. I don't know, we can fight against space pirates or the Techion or the Coalition. Oh, I don't know. There's so many options. They're so amazing. Uh, space pirates. I want to kill me some space pirates because that sounds amazing. Okay, so our target is space pirates. We have to locate and assassinate the enemy commander. Okay, so before I do that, I want to pull some of these guys out for reasons that may or may not actually occur. Okay, so pull those guys out and we're going to... Oops, I need to go back to my mission over here. And this is our space pirates. So we shall accept this mission. So as you see right here, this is the planet with all the different places we can go to on the planet. But we actually have to travel over to our mission, which is kind of cool. And it shows you your distance and everything. So it takes a while to get there. And along your way, you can actually encounter various events like enemies or uh, just like stuff in space that you might want to 
uh, to check out and investigate and things. It's kind of very FTL, if you've ever played FTL. It's really, really cool and adds so much to the game, and I love it. Right, so we are now here. We are at the whatever place this is. Let's get all of our forces into one group, and then we're going to head on over here. Come on, guys. We are going to go down to our uh, beamy platform thing. Come on, dudes. We're going to go kill some space pirates. Who doesn't want to go kill some space pirates? Because I do, because that sounds amazing. So come on down here. Everybody, get down to the beamy platform thing. All right, here we go. Now that everybody is here, everybody who's standing here, will be sent off to the planet so that we can go kill ourselves some space pirates, which is amazing. So that's a lot of sp <laughs> that is a lot of space pirates over there. That is awesome. Okay, so let's get all of our guys as one unit. So this place right here, this is our drop point. This is the place that we can beam ourselves back to space. So if you start to fail, you can actually cut your losses and go back to your drop point and go back to space, which is really, really cool. But we are going to show these pirates the forces of the coalition force, or the power of the coalition force. That's what I was trying to say. So let's kill this one lone space pirate. Four guys versus one lone guy. That'll show them our power, I guess. Maybe. I don't know. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. And fire! Annihilate him! Get that space pirate! Get him! Get him! I don't think I've ever actually fought the space pirate, so I don't know what kind of power they have. But it's not enough to stop us. Oh, yeah! That's one down. And we can pick up his weapon. He's got a TMP. I don't even know what that is. Let's see what this is. What is a TMP? A TMP is... A... A gun that doesn't want to fire. Oh, it's, it's kind of like what we already have. It's a little SMG or assault rifle or something. Hello there, Space Pirates. We've only got to kill their commander unit. But we're going to kill them all because they're dirty spa- I didn't realize you could bring in people from space. I actually thought, okay, kill it, kill it dead, kill it dead. Ki or or kill, kill the guy that dropped, maybe. He's got a shield! Kill him! Kill him! Squish him! Oh, no! We apparently broke his dropship, which is kind of cool. Did I lose- What?! The dropship landed on him! We didn't even have to do anything, and we won! Oh, no. <laughs> we won! But that doesn't mean they're not gonna try to get revenge on us because they are pirates. Kill them! Kill them dead! Come on, get... Uh, that is a... That is a very me start to this whole thing. I didn't even have to kill the first... The, the, our enemy. He just kinda died for no reason. That's kind of awesome. Let's kill the last of these guys. Oh, right here. This is a thing. Okay, let's kill these guys first, and then I will show you something else that is really cool that they added to this mod. Come on, kill those guys! Just arc all the bullets, just rain death upon these evil space piratey douchebags. Okay, there's one, there's one guy left. Let's reload and fire. Everyone, fire at the lone space pirate who is completely defenseless and is all by himself and is probably all scared and uh, helpless and things. We're the heroes, not the space pirates. There we go. Okay, so this thing that you see right here on the ground, this thing right here, let's get everybody off of it is actually a randomly generated, uh, I don't know, drop pod or something. It ha It's an item crate that you can just find in the world. Do I have a digger? I think I did. Where's the digger? There we go. And these will have random items or weapons inside, which is really, really cool. It's a, just a random thing that you will find lying around. Come on, break it open, break it open. Is there anything in here? It is. Let's not... not or we could break the thing that's inside. There you go. I just, it popped out and I broke it immediately. But I saw that there's one over here. So we're going to go ahead and take this one out of here. Maybe we should not use the digger because that came, seemed to kind of kill it. Right, so let's shoot it with a gun. I think we'll just break the pod and it will pop out. So there we go. We got ourselves a sniper rifle. And there we actually got a free weapon out of that. Occasionally you'll even get like things like bodies and things like that, which is just really, really cool. Is there anything in this one? I'm not sure if these are the same sort of thing. Break it open. Break it open. I got a body! It's one of those uh, mercenary things that I don't remember the name of. Circle, whatever that is, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but we could get new bodies and stuff. And as you see there, where it keeps saying connection lost. Wait, did I lose a guy? I still have four guys, right? I think... Connection lost means that you have too many people on the field. I do. You're only allowed to have four down here at once, unless your brain comes with you, and then you have unlimited, but we only have four guys here at the moment. Or we, we don't... Yeah, we didn't bring the brain, so we can only control four. So that one will randomly lose control, and we won't be able to do anything with it. Oh, there's another drop pod thingy. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go and open this. Let's see what's inside this one. So, and all of the, uh, the gold and stuff... Actually, I probably should have pointed this out. All this gold and stuff... Break that open. Come on. Um... You can't use it, it anything. Oh, it's a, uh, it's a, what is this? I think that may be a shoddy. No, it's a machine gun. I don't know. But, um, you cannot actually use this menu right here. You have to use all the systems that are already in place up in space. You, if you try to buy anything here, you got no gold. You can actually stick around and mine up all of this gold that's down here, and it will actually send it directly back to your space station, which is really cool. And you can, you can actually send down mining groups and do that sort of thing. But you can't buy anything here. You can only buy things when you're in space, or you might be able to do drop pods or something at some point. I don't know. At the moment, I can't. Let's get all these guys up here. In fact, I don't think I even need to do that. 
that. Let's select this thing. Okay, mission complete! So, if you haven't completed your mission, only the person who is standing here will be sent back to space. Everybody else will be left behind to die. But, since we've completed the mission, we will take everybody back to space. And what's really cool is, now that we've completed the mission, anything that happens to be down here, like all these weapons and things, are now ours. They will all come back to space with us, which is really cool. So we hold this down, we wait for five seconds, and then everybody will go back to space, because we actually survived, we took everything with us. And here's actually our, um, our mission thingy here, and it's, uh, my... Something is over. Oh, I've got too many people here, so I can't. I want to read this first, though. So, mission complete. We've got 935 gold. Uh, we gained 136 to Circle Reputation. We even got one of their people. We kidnapped one of them, and we gained some reputation somehow. And we have lost reputation with the space pirates, but they're space pirates, so I don't care. We had no casualties, and we collected eight items, which are all the things that are over in here. So, I don't... Do you even have a weapon? You do not have a weapon, so I'm just gonna send you right back up into here, even though you have a really amazing jetpack that's working really well. Oh, no. I've never actually used this faction, so I don't even know what they do. But, for now, we're just gonna go put them up here. So, as you see, they, they're all slowly dying because we don't have enough, um... Uh, stuff for them. So if I leave him there, he should get stuck back in there. And there! Now we have life support, which then put all these guys back to 100%. So if you have too many people out at once, you will- you don't have enough for life support, and they will all slowly die. That is so cool and terrible, but so cool! Alright, so I think- let's see here. Uh, there's our brain. I think- I'm kind of curious. I think there's a way to save. I'm positive there's a way to save, but I'm not sure how to save. I'm kind of curious. I'm going to do this. I'm curious. Will this fail everything? Hey, we backed out, but I'm pretty sure I can just go back into that, so it's totally fine. There is a way to save this, which is really good because I'm going to I'm gonna be going as long as I can. This, by the way, I only get one brain, so it's a good thing that I just completed my uh, hardcore permadeath run because this itself is also a permadeath run because you only get this one brain if you die. This is very roguelike-esque, I guess. Because you, you start off with basic stuff, you gain a whole bunch of stuff along the way, if your brain dies, too bad! You've died, you've failed, you have to start over, which is kind of awesome and totally terrible at the same time. So we've got all this stuff, I don't- okay, all these guys are healed, so this guy's even got a sniper rifle, which is amazing. We are going to go on, and we're gonna get another mission. I wanna see what other missions we can get around here. Oh, I can actually read my report right there. Awesome. Okay, so, what kind of- ooh, we could kill some more space pirates! Or we could see, we got Imperatus, who we kill here? I kinda wanna go kill some brown coats, uh, because we gotta prove that we're better than the brown coats- Oh, is there no, those, those uh, space pirates. I was hoping there'd be some brown coat enemies. Oh, there's not. There's so many of these people I don't know who are, though. Locate and assassinate. So it looks like there's a lot of just kill everybody missions. But I guess we're just gonna have to go with some of those. So since we didn't actually get to kill the space pirates legitimately, what do you say we go kill some more space pirates once again? Because we are now the kings of space. We're taking over. No space pirates are allowed in my domain. So let's go and annihilate ourselves some space pirates way over on the other side of the planet. So there's a good chance that we're gonna run into somebody along the way. I'm kind of curious. We'll find out. And just in case that is the case, I'm gonna go ahead and spread these guys out just a little bit for reasons that uh, you don't probably don't know yet, unless you've actually already played this. I don't know. So we can put this over here. Stand here to receive items. Oh yeah, that's that thing over there. Are we almost there? Are we? No, wait. Oh, did it stop when I moved? I think I didn't know it would do that. Okay, we're going to the space pirates. So this thing right here, right? Okay. Oh, we're here! Oh, okay, that's not where I, I thought we were going all the way to that green thing. I have no idea what the green thing is, we just had to come to here. Oh, that's where this is, if I wanted to, You can actually pick different places on the planet if you just want to go down. So, you've got missions, but you can also just go here. I think these are actually part of these missions over here. So, if you just want to cycle through here, here's all your missions and stuff. But you can just go to areas that have nothing. I can go to the grassland mining facility and just mine, or I could- I, Intel, I don't even know what the intel is. I have no idea, but it's really cool and I like it. So, we are- where we need to be. Let's get our guy over here. Let's just go over here. You know what? This time, this time the brain is gonna come with us because one, it'll allow us to take our new guy, but it will also allow us, let's get everybody over here, it will also allow the brain to get some experience which will hopefully allow you to see we can detach our brain at any time. Will hopefully allow us to get new brain abilities such as perhaps healing himself and also the brain needs a guy. The brain needs to not smack his face on the ceiling and die. That would just be my luck. Let's go over here and get ourselves a new gun of some sort. Maybe I should give him that sniper rifle. I don't know. Let's see. What kind of weapons do we have over here? I don't know. But see, we got a brain to do some breakdancing in space. There we go. 
Okay, what kind of guns do we have? We got, let's see, assault rifle. Let's see, I can just sort these. Pistols, I want pistols, rifles, shotguns. Yeah, we got shotguns and rifles, and we got diggers. Explosive, not giving him any explosives. Never again. Okay, we're going to give you an assault rifle. that goes right there. And we're going to also give you a shotgun, so that you are nice and prepared for our battle against the space pirates. Oh, this is so cool. All right, so, oh, is this a teleporter? Oh, this might be this might be easier to get my people around. Is that what this is? Let's see. Doop -ba -doop -ba -doop. It is the a teleporter. That would be so much easier to get people down from. I didn't know that that was there. So let's get this. Got too many units. Oh, upgrade life support. I don't know how to do that. I have no idea how to do that. So I guess we're not going to take our new unit. I was going to try to take him down there, but I guess we can't. So instead, we're just going to take our brain and our four coalition dudes. Or, yes, yeah, Coalition, right? I think it's right. And we're gonna go down, and we're gonna kill ourselves some space pirates and have a grand old time. So, onward to the planet. Hello. Onto the planet. Oh, this is actually one of the, uh, the base maps that's been used for this. I think this actually has some extra maps. Obviously, the, um, the uh, spaceship is its own map. That's not a normal thing. So let's go ahead and make use of our sniper over here, because we actually found ourselves a sniper rifle. Cub! Oh no, what was that? I don't know, did you guys hear something? Something crazy going on over here. Would you just shoot him through the- I'm kill- I'm shooting him through the foot and killing the guy behind him. How does that make any sense? Would you stop missing? Okay, I'm gonna try this one more time. If this doesn't kill anybody, then I might try it again because I don't want to die. My brain is down here, I need him not to die. I'm slowly digging through the ground with a sniper rifle. Don't worry, this is gonna work! Yes, yes, kill that stupid space pirate. This is what you get for just showing up and killing people and taking their money, which is exactly what I'm doing. I might not be any better than space pirate, but I don't care. That worked really well. All right, so I got yourself a pistol, digger, machine gun. There we go. Okay, so everybody is now a squad, and we're all going to go off this way. We're just going to have a great time assaulting this pirate base that... Hello? Die, 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 die. Okay, there's guys, there's guys, there's guys. There's guys, hello. Hey, could you... Where's my brain? I need my brain to be really far away from all of this. Hey, brain, you don't seem to be part of this, so you just can't even hang out over there for a minute. Okay, everybody... Oh, you've been do... Oh, no, he got squished! Oh, no, no, no. Kill, kill, kill him. Kill him. Kill him before you die. Kill him before you die. Uh, no! Where's my sniper? I need my sniper. Uh, guys, why are you in this hole? Could you stop it? Jetpack. Refill your jetpack. You guys are not... Proving to be as amazing as I was. Oh, that guy died. Cool. Okay, so you go up here. I thought they were all a squad. What happened to the squad thing? Oh, also I have weapons. Let's see what kind of weapons you had. Is this a good weapon? I don't know. I don't care. We got this. We get these guys all up here one by one because they all suck. All right, so we're going to get you guys up here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm going to have to drop some stuff. Uh, drop your pistol and drop your digger. So that you've got more jetpack. There we go. Because all this stuff will be picked up at the end of the round. I need the brain to uh, not die. I don't know if the brain has to just be here or if the brain actually has to get some kills to get experience. We're going to find out because the brain's going to stay back and not die. Because this is kind of a permadeath run because I don't even have a choice in this being a permadeath run. It just is one, whether I like it or not. Oh, don't shoot at the brain, you stupid. Okay. Well, the brain's actually controlling him, so brain, don't shoot it yourself, you stupid. There we go. Uh, there we go. Okay, we got, we got, we got. Okay, up here we go. Okay, we got three guys and our brain. Oh, brain, you shouldn't go in. You should stay over there, brain. I brought the brain in for no reason. I'm afraid to make the brain go anywhere near danger. Okay, so we need to get... Are we killing everybody? Was that the mission? I think we're killing everybody, not a specific target. Okay, cool. So the brain is just gonna hang out up there while we assault all of these dirty pirate scum. Ow, that was a grenade that I stepped on, and maybe possibly a landmine. I'm not entirely sure. Come on over here. We're going this way. Excuse me, Mr. Space Pirate. I I'm here to, um, get the drop on you. No, 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 no. Okay, uh, Space Pirate. Die, Space Pirates. Die, Space Pirate. There we go. We're down to one guy. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we don't have a digger anymore. I dropped the digger because I'm an idiot. Okay, uh, Brain, you okay, Brain? Okay, everything's good. Everything's fine. Nothing to worry about. It's gonna shoot this guy from a distance. Shooty, shooty, shoot. Duck! Uh, reloaded. And shooty, shooty, shoot. Shooty, shoot, shoot. Did you break my gun? Okay, no, I didn't break my gun. Reloading. Okay, lay down. Lay down. Lay down. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, and murderize him while he's not fighting back. Yeah, like a hero. Awesome. Is there anything inside? I should, are there any of these? There's a light digger. Actually, I'm gonna take this digger. Okay, take the digger. Awesome. Because it might work on this guy right here. That could be kind of cool. What's in here? Anything? Anything in this thing? Hello? Break, break. I got a new body! Yeah! It's a space marine! I told you I didn't want space marines in my game! I got a space marine! Oh well, I didn't choose to! I didn't know that they would actually be allowed to be in here. 
I guess I'll just have to live with it, because I'm now unstoppable. Okay, so, <laughs> I did not know that they could still be in here. I didn't pick them as a faction on purpose. Um, oh well. At least I don't have his gun. He's just going to be, he, his face is also exposed. So I don't think I care. Kill him. Kill that, sp kill that pirate. The space marines are here to annihilate your smelly pirate force. Hey, buddy, how's it going? I'm here to kill you with great, um... Uh, that word, that means I don't care if I kill you. Hey, come on, come on, come on. Okay, actually, no, I'm gonna try this. I wanted to try this, we're gonna see if this works. We're gonna kill our final space pirate with a digger, because he's got a shield. No shields for you, sorry. Shields got nothing on my digger. Yeah! We completed two missions! Mission complete. So now we've... We've got... Oh, that's the wrong button. We now have our own space marine. That is amazing. And our brain survived, which is also really, really important. What... No, no, what are you shooting at? I don't even know. Break that open. I want to see what's inside. Break it. Break break this so we can go back to space. Break this. And it's a plasma rifle. I don't even know what that is. Yoink. Yes! Oh, this first outing has been amazing. We've got everything we need. We are now... We're going to be the kings of space. You just watch. We're going to take over all of the space. And there's nothing that anybody can do about it. So, hold this to return back to space. Oh, this is going really well. Oh, I actually brought my brain down. The brain didn't even get shot. The brain got into no combat. But the brain survived, and that's all I care about. So we gained almost 3,000 gold. Yes, or is that how much I have now? Oh, that's probably just how much I have total now. That's still cool, though. We gained 21 experience, so the brain gained experience just by being there. That is amazing. Okay, so 170 coalition reputation minus uh, 281 space pirate reputation. Who would have thought the space pirates wouldn't like me after I killed two of their forces? We lost two units, but we gained 18 items and a brand new unit. We have a freaking space marine. That is just incredibly amazing. So I'm going to go ahead and put my brain up here. I'm actually kind of curious to see if I can buy anything with my uh, newfound experience. Let's find out real quick before we do anything else. Okay, so we go over here. I'm going to put our brain... Come on, brain. There we go. Brain, stop getting stuck, brain. Okay, brain's gonna go back up here because we can reattach our brain. Re re reattach our brain. There we go. Okay, and now, actually, I think I go up here to do it. Let's see, where's our experience? Over here. So we have 21 experience. How much does this stuff cost? Points need only like one? Is that really? Okay, let's see here. Um, Toughness. How much punishment your brain can take? Yes? No? Oh no, it doesn't work. Okay, it's. Level and experience are two different things. I don't know how much experience I need to level up. Oh, I was hoping I could level up my brain. That would have been so cool. It's cool that the brain can level up, though. That is, like, the coolest feature ever. I love it. All right, so I guess I will... Oh, I can take both of you guys. I forgot I have this teleporter now. So let's get... <laughs> I can't believe I have a space brain. I did not... I sincerely did not know space brains could be in this. And I didn't want them to be in this. But now that I have one and I'm not fighting against them, I don't think I care. It's kind of awesome just the same. Oh, they're kind of... Yeah, you go over here, and you go over there, and I'm going to stop using you, so you'll go back into there. And there we go. Again, put you back over here. Okay, so this has been Cortex Command, the Void Wanderers with my big stupid gun. I love it. Um, I don't know how long I'm going to go into this series, because as far as I know, this has no end game whatsoever. It's just wander around in space, accrue crew members, and just take over all of space and do quests and things like that. So I will go, I'm going to at least go maybe four or five episodes into this. And if it starts getting stale, I'll just do a big Rambo run and maybe go out with a, a big glaze, glaze? A big blaze of glory. Or, or go out with a giant donut and have a glaze of glory. I don't know which one it is. But if not, I'm going to keep going until, or as long as it stays interesting. But at the moment, it's super interesting to me because this is a really cool mode. I've only looked slightly into this. So I don't know what everything is. I don't know what this mod really has. I'm pseudo blind in this, so I'm really enjoying this. I've only played it just the ever so slightest amount but it is still really really cool so i hope you guys have enjoyed my space faring adventure so far i love it this is so cool and so different but this has been our first episode hopefully there will be more to come unless i get killed in the next episode i honestly don't know i'm not there yet but i hope you guys enjoyed take care and i will see you in the next episode